Hey everyone, Ken Surfs here. We're back in the shave den. I've been back for one week and uh, I'm going to do another shave. I came home from vacation from Hawaii Monday evening to find out that my cousin Paul is in the uh, ER in critical care on a breathing machine uh, because he has congestive heart failure and he has not been following doctor's orders. He was supposed to give up cigars and uh, take his medicine, and it does not appear that he was doing that. So uh, he's in the uh, critical care, so I had to take the rest of the week off work. My aunt is 87, I had to uh, go take care of her and go visit him. Every day he's improving a little bit, so I'm very optimistic that I will be back in uh, swing and sequence of doing shaves uh, very soon. But it's Saturday, uh, I've been back almost a week and it's time to do a, a shave and I do need one. So somebody goes, hey, it doesn't look like you need one. I do need one. And I'm gonna be using a razor that I don't use too often uh, because I'm not particularly a fan of the head because it's an aggressive head. It is the above the tie with the S2 head, an open comb slant head on it. So I'm not a, too big of a fan of it. It does work good, but you've got to be really cautious with it. So I'm, I'm going to be using this today, and I may abort the mission if I start to cut myself. I have to go meet my daughter's boyfriend's parents tonight at a dinner, so I can't be all cut up. And I was going to be taking uh, the goatee off and trimming it, but what had happened was, is I get a lot of requests from you guys. I know I'm talking. I get a lot of requests from you guys. Can you review... A, an electric razor. A lot of you have beards. A lot of you use electric razors because maybe the DE razor cuts you. You're on blood thinners for whatever reason. And I really was intrigued with electric razors in the mid eighties when uh, Don Johnson was having that, uh, that, that like three day growth. He was using the Braum razor. I forget the exact model, but it's very expensive if you can find it. And it doesn't really work anymore because the batteries or the, the, it's hard to charge. You have to rebuild it. So I did a little research and I found, I still wanted to try a Braun razor. And I think they're up to a Braun Series 7, 9 now. But I did find from watching a couple of you guys' videos, including, I think Sinatra Lennon has done a video on an electric razor. But I was able to buy off eBay a Braun Series 7 electric razor, and what it intrigued me is it has its own cleaning system. Look at that, you put it in, it cleans it, keeps it clean, keeps it sanitized. The box is still sealed. I was gonna be trying out one of these. It's coming soon. So uh, if you don't wanna watch an electric razor video in the future, you don't have to. All right, so I'm gonna be using the above the tie S2 head on there. I'm going to be using uh, Tobbs Taylor of Old Bond Street Grapefruit. I really like this. It's dried up a little bit because it's kind of, uh, it's kind of, it's hardened up. It's usually quite soft. And since I'm still recovering from the sunburn in Hawaii, I will be using a Nivea Men uh, Sensitive Aftershave Balm. And I'm going to just use uh, uh, Wolf Whiskers Synthetic today. In fact, I'll put the synthetic right in the crystal skull and we'll get it going. Been a hell of a week, I haven't even unpacked yet. You know, if you can believe it, it's like, mm. but let's move on. Let's try a shade. All right, wet the face a little bit. Might even try a face lather today. I got the good sunburn or suntan, uh, ended up, you know, getting some good sun. Well, not really back there, right? Just on the front. All right. But it was a fun trip. Sad news to come home though, to, uh, to my cousin, and I'm, I'm hoping and praying for a complete recovery. Mm. Not thick enough yet. Right in the bowl. There we go. Yeah, it was, uh, it's been a long time since I've tried an electric razor. My uh, father had the uh, Arelco, the three-head rotary one, 
And I would try that every once in a while, and sometimes I'd burn my skin, you know, and I've never tried the foil type that this Braun is. So I'm looking forward to unboxing it and giving it a try. Have you guys used the Braun razor? I mean, are you familiar with it? Maybe you can give me some tips. I'd love to hear from you in the comments on this video. All right, here we go. I'm going to try it. It gets the job done in one pass. Hear the feedback? I've got the mileage on the uh, R41, which is another aggressive razor. But I don't, and I bought, I got this as a gift, as I recall, from uh, one of the shavers who found it too aggressive. So I haven't used it too often, but I saw it sitting there. Got a little bit of tarnish on it, stainless steel, but you know, a little bit. There we go. All that talk of me saying it's so aggressive and it's performing well. And I've got a Wilkinson Sword Gillette mild blade in it. Now, I am a fan of Above the Tie, and I really should get a different head, try out some other different heads. You guys have Above the Tie razors? What's your favorite head? What do you recommend? This is an S2. Whoops. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And when he gets, when my cousin recovers, I'm going to have words with him. He has to listen to the doctor. He has to do what the doctor told him. I have kidney issues, so I had to give up drinking over 10 years ago. I didn't want to. I loved my beers, loved my margaritas, but I had to. So, you know, if you want to live, you got to listen to what these doctors tell you. At least you should. Is that my public service announcement for today? Yeah, congestive heart failure and COPD he has, and uh, it was under control. But I think what happens, you start to feel better and you figure, hey, now I can start living the life again and doing all my bad habits. Just took a shower so you can hear the shower dripping in the background there. Well, remarkably, I did not cut myself. <laughs> remarkably. Such a good vacation in Hawaii too. So relaxing. People are so nice. Sights, the water, so blue. My wife and daughter are celebrating Mother's Day tomorrow. My daughter's gonna take her down to the beach in Huntington Beach. And when you go from that, you know, crystal clear turquoise water to uh, <laughs> the dark green that's off my coast. Yeah, it's a big difference. Uh-oh. Someone's in the other shower. I really thought I was going to cut myself. I really, really did. So, good. Above the tie with the S2. And this is the 2015. Can you see that? 2015 model. So I've had this for, for quite a while. Let me hang this up to dry right here. And it's, it's, like I said, it's a slant. Oh, what is going on here? Oh, it's a pull-off top. All right. I was always remember to shake these things. Okay. A little on here. Just a bit. Oh, there we go. No burn, but helps dry out the skin. 
I was supposed to go to my dermatologist uh, this week, but I had to cancel that, obviously. And uh, I'll go next week, so hopefully they don't find too much to burn off so I can continue doing some shaves with you. And I will get back on track. All right, guys? All right. Well, you guys stay safe and follow your doctor's orders, please. And look forward to seeing all, I get, all of you again very, very soon. Thank you very much uh, for watching. Thank you very, very much for your subscriptions. And we'll see you all again real soon. Bye for now.